Hi, welcome. Hi. How is everyone? It's me, Barbara, and she won today. Hi, everyone. In collaboration with Rose Inc. So welcome to our masterclass, and we want to make it very interesting for you. So we will talk you through a routine. We will answer a lot of questions. I will give you a quick introduction what's important about skin. So please be interactive, use the chat button, chat with us, ask questions. Also, if you feel like you want to be part and dial in, come in and we have um, a nice conversation together and you can ask all your questions, okay? So I'm Dr. Barbara Sturm. I am a medical doctor. I started in the orthopedic field and I help pioneering a treatment where um, we take body-owned proteins from the vein, from our arm, and we um, process the blood in a certain way, create anti-inflammatory proteins, and re-inject it into the joints to take down inflammation, and therefore slow down the aging process. There you already see inflammation, aging has like something together. I will explain you this a little bit more. And um, in 2002, I translated the knowledge from the orthopedics into the skin. I started something which you all know today as vampire facial or blood facial. And um, from there, I created a cream because I wanted um, to have something which hydrates my skin. I couldn't find anything on the market which could do that. So I tried every product which was available at the time and um, spent a fortune on um, cosmetic products and nothing would hydrate my skin. So I focused really um, with my cream on hydration and anti-inflammation and this really helped my skin from there all my patients got hooked on the blood cream and they asked me for more and this um, how I started developing some products and now we have a big line and as you all know Dr. Barbara Sturm um, is all about anti-inflammation hydration nutrition telomerase activation and my background um, is anti-inflammation and this is like my orthopedic background and I learned a lot and I um, was um, working a lot with professors from Harvard and Pittsburgh and inflammation is really something which goes together with a lot of skin conditions, goes together with um, diseases, goes together with aging. Um, this is eventually what will kill us um, later on. So inflammation is something we need to get under control in our body and it's not just on our skin, it's our overall health. So inflammation is all around us. It's in pollution, sun exposure, HEV light from the phones, um, our diet, stress, no sleep, um, ingredients we put on our skin can cause inflammation. So all those um, stressors we surround ourselves every day, we can um, get into it by um, you know, watching our diet, going on an anti-inflammatory diet, with, which is basically green leaf vegetable, tomatoes, cherries, olives, um, oranges, um, you know, no processed meat, no sugars, no fried food. Um, going really, um, you know, for salmon, mackerel, um, almonds, walnuts, um, super anti-inflammatory, maybe mostly plant-based and, um, you know, try to go to bed early, try to de-stress, do our workout and, you know, just live a healthy life. But also regarding skincare, we can do a lot to avoid inflammation by not going after products which um, can cause inflammation, um, which are, for example, fragrances, mineral oils. Um, you know, acid peels, um, retin-A, um, you know, all kinds of acid peels, glycolic acid, etc. So we can cause inflammation also in our skincare products. And the whole approach with my line is basically, you know, being anti-inflammatory, super hydrating, um, nutritious and telomerase activating. Um, and there is, um, um, I want to talk a little bit about anti-aging here as well there's like one um, most proven theory of the aging and um, there are lots of theory you know lots of theories the, the live and die theory the hormone theory the food theory it all um, the inflammation theory it all plays a part in aging but um, what's really the most proven theory in aging is the cell division and cell division we as a human body have like 40 to 60 cell divisions of our cells a turtle has 110 so a turtle lives up to 200 years. There you see how the cell division really um, are the life limiting factor here. And <clears throat> telomerase activating is super cutting edge science. Um, telomeres, you might know that, are the little caps, the ends of a chromosome, 
um, which get shortened each cell division. And that's basically what tells the cell to die. So if the telomeres are too short, the cell dies. If we keep our telomeres from shortening, that's really anti-aging. And we can do that with ingredients like purslane, for example. Purslane or also astragalus. Both those ingredients basically are in our skin food, by the way. Um, because we don't only want this for our skin cells, we want this for every cell in our bodies. And it's um, person is in every single product of our line. So we do telomerase activation, which is, um, you know, a professor from Harvard said it's the only proven, um, you know, um, ingredient which, you know, a telomerase as an enzyme is the youth, the fountain of youth enzyme. And he says it's not only, a professor from Harvard says it's not only, um, you know, stopping the aging process, but also reversing the aging process. And they tested this on mice. So just for you to know, um, this is really playing a big part in the anti-aging theory. A quick introduction about skin. Skin is um, our fortress. It's our outside um, organ and it's a really important organ. It's the largest organ. And you all know that skin has functions. Skin has function to protect as well. And protection means that we cannot let in, um, ingredients and stressors into our body, but also um, means that we shouldn't let um, certain things out, um, leave the skin. For example, moisture, you know, trans water loss would be so good. So the skin does thermal regulation, which is very, very important. As a kid, these functions are not absolutely uh, developed. Um, the babies and kids have these functions, but not overdeveloped. So we have to be extra careful with kids' skin. But as an adult, we have like strong skin barrier function and these skin barrier function are absolutely necessary. And how can we make those skin barrier function the best it's possible can be? Because that's important to keep our skin healthy, glowy, and, um, you know, working. You know, it's important to keep the skin working. And the skin barrier um, consists out of dead skin cells, a hydrolipid film, and a microbiome. And a microbiome basically is parasites, bacteria, and viruses. And this is all in our skin. And it's really important that it's all there in the right concentration and the right uh, amount. So. Um, um, it's really important to keep our skin extra hydrated and our skin in a right pH. Our skin's pH is slightly acidic. So this is a, like a real, like a biotope and it needs to stay in this way. If something interrupts these um, concentrations of our um, things on the skin and our skin layers, that's when our skin disrupts. That's when sensitivity can occur. That's when um, our skin can become dry, that's our skin can, um, starts aging um, and being dehydrated and redness irritation, inflammation starts to happen. So um, let's keep our skin in the best shape possible. And that's why I created these products for you because this is what um, makes our skin um, really get all the nutrients, being anti-inflammatory, um, telomerase activation, therefore anti-aging and um, giving the skin what it needs, yeah? Um, so the best anti-aging theory is basically be good to your skin. Be good to your skin and do telomerase activation. Um, also, stay with your lifestyle. Maybe don't go in the um, midday sun and stay there for three hours because sun is very aggressive to our skin and cause a lot of um, free radicals. And you know all the free radical theory. So even when we breathe, we cause a lot of free radicals, but our system, our body has... Uh, ways to catch those free radicals, to neutralize them. And if we overload our body with free radicals, this can come from smoking, alcohol, sun, pollution. Um, if we cause too many free radicals, our body cannot keep up with it. And this is when our cells damage, our tissue damages, and when we see also visible signs of aging on our skin. Um, so it's really important to have this balance, being good to ourselves, treat our skin gently, kindly, and uh, with the right ingredients and also adding in our skincare products ingredients which can help to catch free radicals as well so um and um this applies obviously also to our diet um so um a, a skincare routine a really good skincare routine consists out of um five steps um number one we have to cleanse our skin Cleansing is um, super, super important. Um, and she one can use our cleanser now. This cleanser is amazing because it's extra hydrating. It has aloe vera and urea. Um, it's um, getting the job done. It's like a very foamy, silky um, washing um, 
foam. We love it. It's um, very gentle. It doesn't give you a dry up feeling. It really hydrates already. So all products are really designed to hydrate your skin. You take a pump on your, in your hand and you wash your skin. It gets the job done. Um, also it takes off makeup, um, the dirt from the day, the pollution. So um, cleanse your skin so thoroughly with the cleansing foam. Super important step of your skincare routine. If you have dry skin, you might only um, shower in the morning and not use a cleanser. If you have oily skin, you use the cleanser also in the morning, but definitely use the cleanser every night. Um, super important to cleanse your skin and get the dirt off your skin. Um, also, um, a second step really, really important um, is to exfoliate. And exfoliation is super important. Exfoliation, you do twice a week, ideally, only take off dead skin cells and um, um, she wants going to use our facial scrub, which I love the facial scrub. It's a mechanical way of exfoliation. It takes off mechanically the dead skin cells, but also um, super hydrating this facial scrub. It's amazing actually. And also it um, circulates your skin, um, enhances blood flow, but also um, activates fibroblasts, really important for collagen. So it's really nice to give this massage to your skin. So you do this twice a week. I have it in my shower. I scrub my skin in the shower um i always do my chin because they get a few breakouts and it's great it <laughs> so so um yeah um the second form of exfoliation would be an enzyme cleanser and an enzyme cleanser is the most gentle form of exfoliation also really good if you have rosacea skin or acne skin the enzyme cleanser is a powder and maybe you show how this looks i, I put it on your hand show just how it um, looks so you take a little powder on your hand i do this all in the shower and then you wet the powder um make it white and then um, show how it creates this foamy foamy texture it's so nice and um it, re it really gets the job done super gently so the second form of exfoliation is an enzyme cleanser it breaks down the bridges between dead skin cells and take gently off the dead skin cells um the third form of um Exfoliant would be like um, everything called resurfacing products or acid peels. And they not only take off um, dead skin cells, they're also taking off healthy skin cells. And that's what we don't want. We don't want to disrupt our skin barrier. We don't want to um, uh, make our skin raw and vulnerable and, um, and inflamed. So please um, go for number one, a facial scrub, or number two, an enzyme cleanser, okay, for exfoliation. And just on the raw inflamed, I already used the enzyme cleanser yesterday, which is why I'm not using it this morning. So okay. enzyme cleanser and facial scrub, you ideally only use two, three times a week, okay? Um, also great, um, you know, if you have acne-prone skin or big pores, blackheads, it's really important to hydrate your skin all the time. Um, don't dry out your skin because it will make it worse. If you give your skin um, great hydration and exfoliate twice a week to dead get to dead to get dead skin cells off your skin because um, blackheads are dead skin cells oxidated with the sebum and that's what um, causes the blackheads. And um, if we take off our dead skin cells um, on a regular basis, this can help with pores and also with blackheads. Okay, and always hydrate your skin. Third step of a um, routine of a Skincare routine is a balancing toner. Also with the toner, be really careful. Don't use toners which strip your skin. There are lots of toners out there with, um, which has, have acid peels or um, you know, an aggressive ingredients for resurfacing. So the toner simply should be um, good for evening out the pH. And that's something our cleanser is good too. Our cleanser has a pH of 5.2. Don't use soaps or aggressive alcohols because this really disturbs the pH of your skin and it needs to be slightly acidic. And the, P, the balancing toner balances out your pH and this is important for our skin barrier function, okay? So um, balancing toner, please um, apply after you wash your skin or an exfoliate to balancing uh, the pH, but also strengthen skin barrier function. It has ingredients to hydrate, like hyaluronic acid, it has vitamin E and also better glucan for um, skin barrier functions. So, toning, and then we start with our skincare routine, then we build up, and ideally, um, you know, we have a bunch of serums, the Sturm Serum family, I show you because that's really, okay, this didn't work so well, but we have a lot of serums, and 
if you want to keep it very simple, just take a hydrating serum like our Hyaluronic Serum. Um, but what I want to tell you to the serums, because it's very, very important to know, the serums are the total concentrated super power tools of your skincare routine. And a serum belongs in a very modern skincare routine. Um, don't exclude a serum from your routine because it's absolutely necessary. These are the power tools because ingredients get um, brought into the skin in a very concentrated way. And um, with a water um, solution like um, our Hyaluronic Serum, this happens very fast and very deep. So you can bring active ingredients very deep into your skin. And this hyaluronic seal, for example, has different molecule sizes, and those molecules, the small ones, shoot down very deep. The um, bigger ones um, stay on the surface and give this uh, plumpy and hydrated um, first hydration. But it has the long-term effect because um, those small um, particles shoot into deeper skin layers where hyaluronic acid pla is placed. And then, listen to this: um, if you drink a lot of water, you know, mm -hmm. a lot. Um, your body and um, your skin can bind thousand times its weight as well. So if you bring the molecules deep and then you give your body a lot of water, then it gives this explosion of hyaluronic serum because it um, binds thousand times its weight in water, which is great. So this needs to be part of your skincare routine. Also, what's great about these molecules, they serve themselves as carriers for active ingredients. So for example, um, our um, hyaluronic serum has purslane, telomerase activator, not just telomerase activator, also wound healing, antioxidant, anti-inflammatory, rich on vitamin A, C, and E, rich on beta carotene and omega-3 fatty acids, all amazing ingredients. And um, this purslane gets carried down together with the molecule. So it's a wonderful serum, should be part of everybody's skincare routine. Um, and, and is a serum to be used. Um, she won now is using our mask, which I'm totally obsessed with. This is my favorite. Aloe vera carlin clay mask, also of course has purslane, and this is a total glow tool, and we will show you how to use it. I wanna talk a little more about serums now, um, because serums is really like, um, it's, it's really something we should have in our skincare cabinet, and we have a bunch of serums. So, um, depending on what you want to accomplish. If you have breakouts, you do the clarifying serum. Like this is the clarifying serum. Because it clears up, same time hydrates, also hyaluronic serum, super important, heals your skin. Um, if you want to do extra anti-aging, go for the super anti-aging serum. It has also glutathione. And uh, glutathione is a powerful antioxidant, also helps with hyperpigmentation prevention. Um, for the nighttime, our night serum, super important um, repairing tool, but also filling in fine lines and wrinkles, also hyaluronic acid base. I use it every night, helps with UV damage as well. Um, then calming serum, if you have rosacea, redness, irritation, inflammation on your skin, calming serum, absolute important after sun, after treatments, mosquito bites, everything, scars, healing, totally, it's my house pharmacy at home has chamomile, cardiospermum, um, skullcap purslane, aloe vera, urea, panthenol, super powerful, um, brightening serum, another serum if you have hyperpigmentation, super powerful tool. Yes? We have first... Um, okay, come in. Joining. Uh, Luke, are you there? Hi. Hi, Hi. how are you? Uh, hi, very well, oh, how are you? Your skin looks great, I hope it's all sturm. <laughs> look look what's just arrived amazing. i love it I, i'm very honored thank you i'm a huge fan <laughs> <laughs> your skin looks amazing oh i don't know i everyone says this but i don't believe it no um, you can't believe it. it looks great <laughs> okay thank you so i use obviously all all stern products um but i still f <laughs> thank you so but i still feel i'm i'm, I'm very oily and i'm prone to breakouts um yeah. i'm obviously a skincare fanatic so it's never going to be perfect <laughs> um but you know i just feel like you know you see some people they have almost like glass skin and i feel like mine still has a little bit of texture and i'm just not sure if that's maybe just but that's healthy. good that's a that's good, good thing also also you're a guy you would never have the yeah. same skin there's a difference in hormones and texture anyway per se your skin looks 
super healthy. I mean, don't make something which is amazing more amazing. Don't even <laughs> go that way. Because if you try to make it more amazing, you can um, cause a lot of problems to your skin. Okay. So if something is great, don't try to overachieve. With your breakouts and um, oiliness, do you use the, dar um, the darker skin tone line? Which line do you use? No, so I've got the darker skin tone cleanser and enzyme cleanser. Perfect, perfect. Um, I have the uh, clarifying serum, hyaluronic acid, uh, the uh, super anti-aging, the clarifying moisturizer, the <laughs> face cream light, um, the You're toner, <laughs> the repair food. Um, yeah, You're so I just... You're so good. You have like the perfect, you, you really got it. You have the perfect um, combination of products. Okay, yeah. I just, you do. It's just me, yeah. I want all of them. <laughs> no, but it's great because you have everything to hydrate, do anti-aging, exfoliate gently, um, 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 controlling sebum production, and, and really um, you know, help with clear, clearing up spots and, and breakouts. You have really an amazing... Um, Treatment. So tell me one thing. Do you wash your face morning and night? Yes. Good. That's what yeah. I would do too. I'm a little OCD, so. <laughs> okay. Okay. Yeah, no, but you're doing all the right things, you know, um, literally. Um, do you do a lot of sports? Um, I do yoga every day. Yeah. Um, but I don't drink. I don't smoke. I, all I do is drink water, but I, I don't know. I, maybe I just need to accept that Barbara Sturm has just told me that my skin's amazing. <laughs> no, you are. You do. I mean, you have to... Great lifestyle, wonderful. I mean, sounds you do anti pollution right. drops as well. I'm using because I, I live in London. I just wanted to talk about it. This is such an important step of your routine, especially now when we sit in front of the computers and the AGV light hits our skin. And the AGV light is so aggressive, and I think it's really important to do protection from that because some people really um, get acne from pollution, and this has a screen to block out AGV light and pollution. And it's so important, I put it on right now. Also, if you sit in front of the computer, um, reapply it throughout the day because it gives you this instant hydration. Um, and not just that, it just really creates a shield to block out the dangerous blue light, which is same aggressive as sun, sun you know, UVB, yes. UVA. Okay, yes, okay, all right. I will keep using that. And also my face masks as well. I've been using the... Oh. I'm a teacher, so I've been actually teaching looking with my face mask on this week. <laughs> That's amazing. That's such a good idea. What teacher? Yeah. What are you teaching? Um, primary school. So Aww. 10 and 11 year olds. Oh, great. So Great. Cool. So yes. Um, okay. Oh, well, thank Send you so much. Send them to much. skin school. Send them to skin school to learn yes. about their skin. My sister is 13. I've sent her to skin school. Perfect. <laughs> Do you want to come <laughs> work for us? Please, can I? <laughs> I'm leaving teaching. <laughs> I wanted to get into skincare. I'll go to work for you. You're taking over skin school. Perfect. <laughs> yes. Oh, thank you so much. It's been an honor. <laughs> so nice to meet you. Do everything right for your skin. Keep doing okay. that. Thank you so much. Bye. Thank you. See you later. Bye. See you later. Bye. Yeah, anti pollution drops is really a serum everybody needs to have. And, um, you know, it's all about skin health, keeping your skin super strong because. You know, we are all interested in how to stay healthy. So we are interested in, you know, wellness, diet, um, a program, how to, how to keep us away from diseases and um, possible aging. And um, I think we're doing so well with our lifestyle, um, but, but, but sometimes we really are aggressive to our skin. So, you know, um, if you can stay away from lasers and acids and be gentle and nice to your skin, I think that's the philosophy of the Sturm family and I think that's something uh, more and more people adapt to it because it really shows you know how to achieve like beautiful healthy glowy skin if you manage to keep your skin very function strong and healthy and hydrated your skin will um this would be 90% of your win you know 90% of healthy skin is just designed in that so hydration nutrition strong skin very function um and then you add telomerase activation um, which is great. So um, normally, if you see how great um, um, she wants, skin is very hydrated right now. Yeah. So if you know, if you put on the mask, our um, hydrating face mask, and uh, it disappears into your skin right away, this is a sign of dehydration. So it's really um, important you do the mask um, 
from time to time. Um, and I, we almost do it every day right now yeah. because we're inside and we walk around and that you can sleep in this mask. And it's such a hydration tool and gives this um, really deep, intense hydration, but also soothes the skin. Uh, let me show it to you. Aloe vera cowling clay mask. It's um, getting the job done. Um, it's a great mask um, for hydration, but also if you have irritated skin, it's great after, if we ever go back to the beach, after um, beach life, it's a beautiful mask. Aloe vera is such a powerful healing tool, but also um, it's a great hydrating tool. So um, I, I, we love this mask. Everybody's obsessed with this mask, actually. So this should be in your skincare closet as well. So here you see um, it's drying a little bit. And what I love to do with the face mask, I actually like to roll it off. And it means um, when your face mask disappears into your skin, you just hold your skin and you start peeling it off. It comes off in like little rolls and um, you peel it off. It's very meditating, but I love it. So I roll and then I rub it off, makes a lot of mess, but it's so good because when you do that, your skin will come, become super smooth, soft, baby butt smooth, really hydrated, glowy, dewy. So I actually do this um, every time before also going to an event or something when I want my skin to be extra good. I do the mask first and then I put the hyaluronic serum on top of my face cream and then my skin is ready to go. And the glow drops are um, super, I actually put them on. I don't, I think we missed that part. So I do it again. The glow drops are amazing to refine pores, but also um, help with an instant glow and hydration. And I just love this so much. And you can mix it in your foundation. You can put it on top of foundation. You can just use it by itself. I always have it in my purse. I mean, I really have it always with me. My glow drops are my everything. And this was like a really um, um, a fun product for me to design. It was my fastest product from the idea. I had the idea end of January and it was in the shelves in September. So the first sample we made was already amazing. I tweaked it a little bit. Um, the second one went into production. It was the fastest thing ever. I love the glow drops so much and um, I don't know who else has them from you, but um, it's like a really cool product to have for, um, you know, refreshing your, your clothes throughout the day. By the way, one thing I want to tell you, um, you know, if you wear masks now a lot and you go outside and, you know, we all have to wear um, um, those facial masks, you know, what's really great um, because it's very irritating to use the mask, to wear the mask all the time, put the calming serum underneath because it hydrates and soothes the skin and, and protects the skin from any um, disturbance from the mask. So um, that's a really great serum to have. I'm going to just put on some hyaluronic serum now. Look at her I've, skin. I've taken off my mask so that you can see. My skin feels very gorgeous, but I need to hydrate it. So. Your skin is super hydrated, but you know, to get the perfect, perfect glow now, we, um, this is the absolute glow to you put the hyaluronic serum on top. This is, whenever I put this on, it just makes me feel so relaxed. It goes into your skin straight away. You know, with hyaluronic serums, and that's probably, um, you know, I already told you about hydration and the hyaluronic serum is really the best hydrating tool. And what happens, you know, when you um, look at the skin, you know, baby skin cells get born and then they walk up, they get born on the bottom, they walk up to the surface and they become dead skin cells and then they flake off. That's the skin cycle and it happens every 28 days. So um, the skin cells need to be hydrated. If the skin cells are not hydrated, they look basically can compare um, a dehydrated skin cell with a raisin and a hydrated one with a grape. And the grapes have like all these amazing osmosis channels where active ingredients can be transported into the skin cells. It's really important that the cells have all those nutrients in, um, in, in order to fully work. And we need those skin cells to, to work and being like super functioning because we want to go through all the um, cell cycles and through all the cell division. So we need to have like really working um, cells and therefore the hydration part is important. If hyaluronic acid goes into all layers, it hydrates from below and above and keeps your skin cells hydrated in order for them to take on active ingredients. Really, really important. Besides, it um, refills our hyaluronic acid reservoirs um, in deeper layers, also keeps our collagen and elastin moist, which is important to protect from aging. So it's one of the best anti-aging tools, the hyaluronic serum, and it really goes um, into deeper layers 
um, it has a long-term effect. Your skin looks amazing. So hyaluronic serum, all mo a lot of my serums are hyaluronic serum based. So the anti-pollution drops are hyaluronic serum, the hyaluronic serum, the super anti-aging serum, the night serum. Yes. Yes. Nicole. Hi, Nicole. Hello, can you hear me? Hello, welcome. Hi. Hi. How so are nice you? nice to meet you. It's also beautiful yeah, skin. Everyone's glowing today. Thank you. <laughs> I'm so great, grateful to virtually meet you and your family and your team. Good morning, or well, good afternoon. Good I'm morning. In <laughs> so I am 47 years old. Um, I have neglected my skin for upwards of maybe a decade because I, I, um, I have three children. Um, my middle child is eight. And when I uh, had him and my subsequent daughter after that, I didn't do anything about skincare. So I am literally just embarking on a, a skincare, well, looking for the appropriate skincare routine for myself. And I came across your, your name in so many Google searches. And I am so grateful to be able to speak with you to get some level of, of uh, guidance as to what I can do. What do I do? <laughs> what do you do? So it's actually, it's, you, you, for you as a mother of three, it's probably to, um, to be good, to be really simple. And yeah. um, is there anything you suffer from? Anything you would say, oh, I have like um, some problematic areas or this bothers me. Is it aging? Is it any type oh. of problem? In my mind, I think I'm 22. So in my mind, I don't think that's good. Is, but I'm sure my skin may be showing it. Um, I have uh, monthly, I get these little uh, one single pimple that shows up every time of the month. Yes. Um, and you can yes. see those there. Um, I don't think, I really would say that it is um, discol um, uneven skin tone, I think. Yes. Um, yes. Possibly just working around my eyes. I don't. I don't have um, like the the lines no. here. I don't have that. But I don't know if that means that I should not be working towards it. Yes, uh, I think that's very very correct. So um, uneven skin tone, and it's a lot. If um, you have more melanin in your skin, your skin is prone to more inflammation, and you get a pimple once or in a while here. And even if it's a tiny pimple, um, the 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 um, the higher production of melanin causes a lot of inflammation right. and something which happens then it's called post-inflammatory hyperpigmentation and that's what you call an uneven skin tone so i created actually a line especially for those um problems um to be extra anti-inflammatory antibacterial and evening out the skin tone and um it's called for darker skin tones um yeah here so um it's a line especially designed for those um, problems also you know um it's 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 not it's it's really great also for oily skin for example it has a cleanser an enzyme cleanser um, um a hyaluronic serum for darker skin tones it's just really designed to also evening out the skin tone and okay. i think that's together with being anti-inflammatory but also antibacterial it's really really great and helping with oiliness as well um, so it's really, it's actually a really great line also for acne prone skin. It's a great line. If you have hyperpigmentation, it's, okay. um, I personally use the darker skin tone line myself. Um, and we have put this together in a little bag for travel sizes. So oh. you could start with that and uh, it's right there. Um, the, the, the travel size um, darker skin tone set. So you can start with the travel size kit so you can use it all together um in smaller sizes and then you can try it out um for yourself okay so it has like um smaller sizes and this would be amazing and then what you add to it what i would definitely add is the super anti-aging serum also okay. for around the eyes and the eye cream okay okay yeah? that's phenomenal if, you, if you're ready to take a supplement i also would take the skin food okay Okay. Yeah. And another so thing, I add some stuff onto your, another thing, what I would use as the uh, um, sun drops. As okay. Sunscreen, SPF 50, um, important. And, you know, uh, although with melanin, you are better protected for the, uh, from the sun, you still have, you know, um, sensitivity to your Absolutely. skin, to the sun. And that's why it's also good 
to protect with a um, with a sunscreen. Um, anything else? I wanted to give you something else, and now I. Um, ah, yeah, the brightening food. We also have a brightening food, which helps with um, unevenness of skin tone, and it's also a supplement. Oh, my goodness. Phenomenal. We have so much stuff. Uh, you can you can also schedule um you can schedule um a virtual FaceTime consultations with my estheticians and yes, um, we can um, do FaceTime consultation give you a little more um specific help um this is the brightening food go on the link and bio on our Instagram and learn how to schedule a FaceTime consultation or just um, email at service service at drsturm.com oh I'm on it. I am so on it. Good. Thank you so much. So nice to meet you. <laughs> you too. You take good care. Be well. You too. Bye. Bye. <laughs>
you know. And if you want to work against pigmentation, you can even add the brightening serum before the moisturizer. So, so it's a little bit. Hmm? Yeah, what would be the difference between the night serum and the anti-aging? Does it overlap or not really? So the anti-aging um, is super hydrating and it has um, glutathione and purslane in it, yeah? Um, and they're super, super antioxidants, help with, um, you know, um, sun damage, UV repair, hydration, anti-aging telomerase activation. The night serum is really designed um, to also do even more repair, also rebuilding collagen, sun repair, a soothing skin, strengthen skin barrier function, filling in fine lines and wrinkles. You should use this overnight, do you? <laughs> <laughs> uh -huh. I was just thinking. So this but is I do. Yeah, so, so, but that's a really that's a really great preventative serum as well. So that's why I used that's why I used both. You know, and I mm -hmm. I'm such a minimalist. I really don't like to use much stuff because I everything has to be fast, fast, fast with me. But um, sometimes I think, oh, tonight I only used the night serum moisturizer and I'm done. So I want to be very fast. And I, I, I feel like my little, my little um, mind saying, no, 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 no. You go super anti-aging. And, and I always do it. I always do both. I always do both. I convince myself to take those um, extra 20 seconds, really. But it just, it's, it's really worth it. And my last thing, so um, it's quite trendy to also use vitamin C in the mornings. So does any of your serums? Um, yes. So with vitamin C, you have to be really yeah. careful. Vitamin C actually is in um, also the glow drops and in um, my, um, in my um, um, enzyme cancer, but with vitamin C. And it's in all my products for the first thing, which is biofermented and it has a lot of vitamin C in it. You have to be careful with the vitamin C serum. It needs to be in the concentration um, beneath 5%. If it's higher than 5%, it destroys skin barrier function, can cause redness, irritation, sensitivity. So it's too much. And most serums are just too much. Um, stay under 5% and it's amazing. Okay. Thank you very much. Thank you. Yeah. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. Nice to meet you. So next we have Erica. Erica. Hello. Hi Erica, how are you? Hi, I'm good. Um, nice to meet you. I've been loving your products. Um, I've been wanting to add the brightening serum into my routine and I just was wondering if it would be uh, better to use it in the morning or the evening. You can use it both morning and evening, so you get the full, um, you know, you get the full effect like throughout day and night. Because also ingredients um, sometimes are even more active at night because you are like, you know, your body is not, you know, caught up in other stuff, you know, and doesn't have to function, and you're just lying there and your skin can concentrate on repair and, um, you know, rejuvenation. So it's actually also good to um, use it at night. Okay. Um, yeah, I'm just like getting ready to enter my 30s, so I'm like trying to figure out. You look like routine. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> it's your <Yeah>. products. <laughs> I love it. No, you look amazing. Do you take the skin food? Um, no, I haven't done any supplements yet. Yeah, do the skin food. It's amazing, especially as prevention. Wonderful. Okay. <laughs> um, Where are you right now? Um, I live in in Colorado but I grew up in Hawaii so um, I got a lot of, got sun, a lot of sun yeah yeah, yeah you got a lot of sun so it's good maybe for you also to um, do like prevention I mean you really look like 12 but um, maybe do the super anti-aging serum at one point also the night serum for repair um, purposes yeah I think it's okay. really good to get into um, you know also the, the the skin food I think 30 is a really great great age to start with all of those you know okay yeah i've just been like slowly i do the hyaluronic serum and like very good anti-pollution drops and I'm kind of very like what, what else do i need more to start doing preventative stuff <laughs> yeah so for the nighttime routine i mean like you know um for the nighttime routine maybe those two in the brightening serum so you slowly i mean you can add one you know you know, at the time, maybe if your hyaluronic serum is empty, you exchange it to the super anti-aging serum 
and then slowly ease into it. But I think it's nice, you know, especially when you got a lot of sun as a kid, you know. Also, what's great if you get some sun, um, always the calming serum, also amazing, amazing for healing and, um, you know, help with inflammation, irritation. Yeah, I definitely do have redness. I think I yeah. get some rosacea and stuff. Yeah, so. that's, yeah that's all like, um, also could, um, you know, the calming serum probably would be super beneficial for you. will love that. It's one of my favorite, favorite serums. Okay. <laughs> I've got more to buy. <laughs> I know, but you know what? The thing is, you don't have to use it all, all the time. So they last also super long. You just need like a few drops. You don't need to use a lot. You know, I think the products last for quite some time. I think the cleanser, I think the cleanser lasts for a year or something, you know? Okay. Yeah. That's, then it's like a worthy investment, I think. <laughs> but yeah, I've been loving your stuff so far. So, so far I'm like, well, I, I think it's worth the money, you know, it's making my skin. Yeah. Better. Just, you know, just rather do less, but then really go high quality, you know? Yeah. So like instead of trying a bunch of things, which I was doing, I was like trying everything. And then I, was, I think I was just like aggra aggravating my skin more than helping it. We also have everything in small sizes, like travel sizes. You know, and you can start trying those. Also, right now, if you go on our website, moleculacosmetics.com, we do a lot of, like, you know, super special deals on stuff. So bundles. bundles, you know. So you can, I can check that out, too. Yeah, sounds good. Um, thank you. <laughs> Amazing. So nice to meet you. Stay Bye. safe. Thank you, too. You, too. Bye. 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 Next, we have Jessica. Jessica. Oh, there's Jessica. Jessica. Hello. Hi. Hi. Thank you for you? this uh, master class. Um, I think you answered partly my question earlier about the darkest uh, skin yes. line, uh, which is good for uh, sensitive skin. Um, I was wondering as well, since I have more dry skin, should I go for the darker skin tone line uh, in the rich face cream or maybe for like its brightening effect, the serum plus the regular uh, face cream rich? Uh, yeah. Is it as moisturizing as the um, regular? I would, do, I would do the regular face cream rich and I would do the hollering serum from the darker skin tone line. Oh, okay. No, the, uh, not or the, the brightening, the brightening skin? serum. Okay. I already have your hyaluronic acid. Perfect. And then add the brightening serum and the face cream rich. Okay. Because the ingredients are quite similar between the two. Okay. Oops. Oops. <laughs> All right. So uh, the regular skincare line is a uh, face cream uh, line is more moisturizing than the darker skin toned line. Is that it? Yeah, because it, uh, the darker skin tone lines also created a little bit for more oily skin, you know? Um, okay. So it's just, um, I think if you have super dry skin, I would go for the regular um, um, line face cream rich. With another serum. Okay, perfect. Thank you very much. So nice to meet you. Thanks. Stay you. safe. Yes. <laughs> now we have Victoria. Hiya. Hi. Hi. Hi, so um, thank you firstly for doing this today, it's great. Secondly, I um, suffer from acne, just like problematic areas just on my chin here. I'm often scared to put anything on it through fear that it'd be too aggressive. Is there anything yes. that you can recommend? Yes, so um, first of all, did you check your diet? Do you eat meat and dairy? I try to reduce dairy um, and I don't really eat much red meat. If anything, I eat chicken or fish. Yes, so... Um, Maybe try also to, to not do the chicken for a little bit and maybe um, totally exclude your dairy. Um, what about sugar? I know it's like rice, bread, pasta, all this kind of stuff. Uh, yes. Yeah. So rice, bread and pasta, I don't, I avoid mainly. Um, yeah. Chocolate here and there. Ah, yeah. Okay. Okay. <laughs> that's, that's fine. Yeah. So everything in moderation, of course. Um, do you have more oily prone skin or more dry skin? Um, I think where I've been trying to use products for acne, I've found they really, really dry out to the point where it almost yeah. goes You see, that's the problem because, um, you know, acne products always dry out your skin and that's not good. You need to have hydration in your skin. So what I yeah. wanted to, um, to, to try is the clarifying. 
clarifying um, line. Um, it's, um, the, the, this face cream is super hydrating, anti-aging, and also helps with clearing up your spots. And the same with the um, clarifying serum. And then for twice a week, you use the clarifying mask. And we have a spot treatment you put right on your spots. And we have it in a tinted and an untinted version. So this is like, goes right onto your spots. Amazing. You see it just oh, like, wow. okay. it is um, 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 tea tree oil and zinc. It's really nice, smells super good. I love it. And would it. that be something that you put under your foundation, for example, under a concealer? Yes. On top of yes, like yes, 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 yes. And it's really important, you hydrate your skin at all time, never dry out your skin. Yeah. Also when you use foundation or anything, always do your skincare first. It's really important. Um, um, also, what I would use is the cleanser and enzyme cleanser from the darker skin tone line. And we have bundles on the website right now where it's like, um, it says adult acne and you can get the whole bundle of products together. And um, it's like really um, great price for, so you can get the whole thing, the whole lot, uh, the whole, you know, exactly. regimen together. So then you have it all, um, every everything what you need also you know what's really great if you have these breakouts is the repair food um it's one of our supplements here it also has zinc you know zinc also yeah. helps to clear up acne yeah. um do you take um b vitamins right now uh which one sorry the b's b vitamin b12 or something I don't know. Okay, good, good, good. Because sometimes this can also cause breakouts. Sometimes, uh, do you have um, hormonal breakout once a month or like on a regular base? Um, I think originally it was once a month, but now it's kind of, it's more prominent. Um, and I also then worry about the little scars that it leaves. Yes. Uh, at the end. Yes, so that's why it's important. It's, it's important to get um, this under control because otherwise yeah. you will end up with scars. So I would try this line, you know, and try to get it under control, adjust your diet, maybe even get a um, um, blood work done to see how your hormonal panel is. Sure. And then if, and if you can't get it um, under control in the next four to six weeks, I would really think of, you know, maybe um, getting some antibiotics or uh, maybe going to the dermatologist and see what else to do because it's, it's really good to get this under control before it scars and don't squeeze it. Don't work on it. Leave it alone. Yeah. yeah? Let it heal. Brilliant. Thank you for your help. Really appreciate it. So nice to meet you. And you. Thank you. Bye. 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 Next we have Camille. Camille. What a nice name. Hi, how are you? Hi. Um, some friends of I and are on this too, and we're all like completely obsessed with all of your products. And all of your products. So, oh, thank you. Um, That's so sweet. But what we all want to know is like, what would be the best ones to have? We're all in our forties, got hormones, kids, stress, all of that. So we want to like buy everything, but for the most part, you know, we've done your hyaluronic serum. Yeah. I have your um, glow drops. I think I need the toner, but you know, we live in the Midwest and the seasons change and it's cold yeah. one day, humid the next day. Oh. So it's kind of like, what would be the best serum that if you were like, you have to have this and you need this, what would be like your suggestion on that? So if the climates change, um, you definitely should have probably two different moisturizers, one for humid climate. And um, do you have more oily prone skin or more? I think I have skin? combination, kind of combination. combination. You know? Like in you the see, summer, yeah. I don't wear a lot of makeup and stuff, but I spend the weekends at the lake in the sun. Yeah. You know, so, so it's, I think it's good if you have like two moisturizers. Number one, um, a lighter version for the T zone and for humid climates, you know, if it's humid outside, and then uh, the normal face cream for the parts where it's dry and um, you know, for the colder months. So maybe you do the normal face cream or the face cream rich and the face cream light. So you have two which you can like, you know, use and, and you know, alternate and just um, use the, the um, parts of the, of the face where you really need more or where you need less. And then as for um, the best anti-aging tools, please use the skin food, two pills a day, it's life changing. You will love, love, love this. You know, also okay. it's hydrating from the inside. It's really anti-aging. I really want you to use that. 
also what you guys should have, you know, maybe uh, when you're done with your hyaluronic, the next hyaluronic you get is the super anti-aging serum. You know, okay. switch to the super anti-aging serum and also definitely get the night serum. The night okay. serum is life-changing and it also helps with fine lines, wrinkles, you know, we need to really start um, working towards um, also repairing and um, helping to, you know, um, get like our collagen built up and you know this has ingredients like for example cotton thistles in here which helps to rebuild collagen which is amazing um so i would use those um i don't know if you're interested in something um to enhance your performance like you know if after you uh, moisturize there's this um, lifting serum which is amazing you can I have put on lifting serum. yeah it's so I good have, it, yes i have that and I put it on my neck and eyes i yes. love that's one of my favorites yes and so hands in the and my, forehead in the anti-aging and um, does it have like the same potency or the same amount of hyaluronic it's a little that, less but it's still uh -huh. super it's you can also use you know what i do but i also own this brand you know i i have it all yeah it's different you know but if, if you want to use I use the hyaluronic serum in the morning and then in the evening I use um I use that, you know. So oh, okay. I switch it up. I do something in the morning and something at night, you know, and I use the anti-pollution drops in the morning as well. Okay. And then my moisturizer. And yeah. so the sun drops, that would be another thing, like just on the weekend. Yes, when you go in the sun. Yes. Okay. Sun drops. Okay. Yes. And they're amazing. It's such a nice skincare product, you know, it's not like a sticky, stupid sunscreen. It's really um, um, a beautiful skincare product. It hydrates. It also has ingredients to soothe the skin. And, um, you know, especially when you are in the sun, um, it's at the same time already like helping to, um, to repair the sun damage, you know? So it's like it protects, but at the same time already helps with irritation, okay, you know? Okay. Well, thank you. Thank you so much. We were all just wondering. So thank you. Did you do you use the eye cream? Um, do, do I need to, does it look like I need to? No, but, but, but no, that's another <laughs> I always great love product. Ice cream. I don't have your eye cream yet, but. Yeah, but have it because it's another great thing for, you know, 40 plus. I mean, you should yes. use eye cream earlier, but this is another amazing product. You will love okay, this eye cream. Eye cream. Okay. Cause usually like summertime, I don't like to wear like a full face of makeup and everything. But that's. So. And, and this is so light. This eye cream is so light, but it gets the job done, gets the most amazing um, hydration, but also helps with fine lines, dark circles, and okay, puffiness. Great. Okay, thank you so Convinced. much. Convinced. <laughs> <Okay>, thank you. <laughs> so nice to meet you. All right, nice to meet you. Thank you. <laughs> Bye. Bye. I've just put a little bit of lip balm on. Okay, you're going really I'm hardcore going today. today. <laughs> so just so don't know where to go. She won't just uses the lip balm. Lip balm. It's one of my hardest products to ever make. I actually had to write my name on it. Yeah, we're very baby steals. Yeah, so I, I'm going to do them first. So when I say the glow drops were my fastest product, the lip balm was my slowest product. It took me years and years and years, 35 samples back and forth, but it's the most beautiful hydrating combination of valuable oils, shea butter, lanolin, um, beeswax. Such an amazing yeah. product. I use it on my cuticles, on my toenails, on my elbows, eyes, whatever. So it's an amazing healing balm, yeah? Um, another product I think you guys should um, start using, which is amazing, take care of your scalp, our scalp serum. Oh, it's, I, I, I mean, I just love, love putting it. I just yeah. love how it feels. It just um, makes my scalp so, oh, so nice. Especially when you've been out. And yeah, you know, when you're out in the sun, pollution hits, then you blow dry your hair, you straighten your hair, you dye your hair. Um, all the stress we cause to our hair. And the scalp serum is amazing. Also great for beard, for eyebrows. I'm just telling you, this is a um, product to look out for. I know there's a lot, but um, it's really an amazing collection. And um, I, I've been using everything. Um, all the time and I'm not a beauty junkie, but I got addicted to my products. Yeah, I am a beauty junkie and I am also addicted. <laughs> so, um, so yeah, please everyone um, come keep joining um, Skin School Masterclasses. Um, the ones who haven't watched the Maskathon yet, 
go on YouTube, watch the Maskathon. It's so nice. I had such amazing guests to deliver a really great message right now. Very inspiring. So um, watch the Maskathon. Book your online FaceTime consultations. If you need us, um, just text us um, on Instagram. Um, we are always available. I love chatting with you. Um, to everyone who came in to this masterclass, thank you. I'm, I'm really um, so excited to see every single one of you. And um, we love doing it. We're here, yes. not going anywhere for now. So um, we keep doing this with you. We're sending you so much love. Rosing, um, um, so, so nice for hosting us um, today. And uh, we are big fans. Sending you all love. Yeah, lots of love. Thanks, everyone. Bye, everybody.